Pete Weber. This is really all his fault. Calm down, Chunky. The biggest single event in our sporting lives is coming up, and you're telling me to calm down? I was a kid. All kids have heroes, right? Because him, his PD was different, because I had everything. I had the posters and the autographed pictures, the sunglasses. Stupid smoking ban. Come on, dude. All I'm saying is that. Uh, uh, all I'm saying is what? You know, I never met him. I never actually met him. Dad did. At least he said he did during his time on the tour. I paid for weeks. Just never happened. It was too young. That's what Dad said. Man, to have met him just once. Wait, now which one was he again? Look, first you talk me into being team captain again. Yeah, then so you question what little authority huh? I do have. You have over the nerve to tell me to calm down. Then you replace our best friggin' roller a month before the tournament. Really? It's kind of a touchy subject, man. Look, a little touchy. With this moron. What about him? He's wearing sandals. They're comfortable. All right, who wants a beer? Which one? Pete Weber. P.D. David Weber. P.D.W. Come on, man. I mean, he's only the Michael Jordan of bowling. <clears throat> the Mickey Mantle. The Dale Earnhardt. It's freaking Pete Weber. This is exactly my point. One, two, three. Oh, of course. <clears throat> Champagne, sir. Fine, just, uh, let's By the time he was 30, you know that? If you don't learn how to walk in heels, you can't be my friend anymore. Sorry. Pete was named PBA Rookie of the Year. He had 19 major titles and freaking triple crown. You don't beat the person, you beat the pen. Jesus, see? What I'm gonna beat is that pretty mouth off your face. You person. know what, I'm gonna take your stupid bet. I just think it's dumb. You know he can do it. Half of the damn shit that comes out of his mouth it's is- It's from a damn movie. Oh, oh, by the way, that was from- Dreamer, yeah. I know, jackass. Shell, don't you think I know? Whose idea was it anyway? Okay. And you, sir, quit stalling. Beer, please. Oh, this should be good. Point is, my third decade of existence comes to close in exactly 29 days. And what do I have to show for it? Look, Guys, I read something. Oh no, Kaz, not this, not the whole... Yeah, in the paper this morning. It said the average age of marriage for a female professional college graduate in the mid-southern region of the continental United States is 25. Two five. See, this is why I don't read. She's never been average at anything in her life. Like, I've really never seen anything. <laughs> Kaz, you can't be serious. What? I'm... Anyway, I'm older than you guys, and I would rather have a three-toed claw than get married. Right, that's you, Jules. Cast 29 days. Not only will I be well past 25, I'll be out of my 20s completely. Two nine measly days. A month from two days ago to find a suitable life mate. A husband. A needle in a douche stack. Not only do I have to fall in love with him, I then of course have to make him fall in love with me, and then there's the elaborate plotting of Oh my god! Oh my like, god! Like, oh god! It's him! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my sweet oh lord of us. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! What on earth is a beautiful it's stallion him. like that doing in a stable like this? It's him! Him! Who? What? Oh what the hell is Oh, it's him. It's him. Him who? Wait. You mean the attractive one, right? Oh my god, isn't that? Pete Weber! <laughs>